everybody, it's Kim from Katie Diamond Paints. Good morning! Oh, and in case I don't see you, good afternoon, good evening, and good night. <laughs> if you're new to my channel, thank you so much for stopping by. And if you've been here before, I so appreciate your return business. I hope I can keep you entertained. This is huge, you guys. We are going to have to talk faster than we've ever talked before. This is a GBFKE haul. Yeah. Crowd goes wild. No, Bell. No. I haven't had one in, I don't know, maybe two weeks or something. Oh, holy cow. Do you see this? How many is this? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Oh, eight, nine. Hey, we got a naked one. Ten, eleven. Oh, and then we've got some random stuff here, some tools. So, I don't know. I don't know if we can do it. We need some vitamin C boosts, you know, some iron shot. I am Hans. Yeah, I'm, I'm Franz, and we, we are here to pop. pop. You are. Or whatever. <laughs> let's let's start with this guy. Let's push this stuff. Let's try to move it away. This is a roller. How cute is this one? This is a little bit smaller than I've seen before. Let's see. Oh, and it's it's a plastic little guy. So GBFKE sends me these packages and I don't choose anything from them so I'm not ever sure what's in them. But I will go and check for you and find out a price on this. But this is a mini one and it is plastic so I'm not sure. I'll, oh no, I'm, use, I'm putting some pressure down there. So yeah, that seems like it's a good little tool. Roller. It's, it's a little baby one. So cute. We'll have to try that out on an actual diamond painting, right? Just to make sure. And then there's this piece that's an accessory. Like, do like little kids do. Shake, shake, shake. Oh, here we go. Let's use the knife. Okay, it's tin. It is tin. It sounded like tin, but I didn't know. Oh, wow. So I'm not sure what this piece is for yet. That looks like it's a, right? It's a hanger. Look at all the pieces in here. There's a hanger. There's a straightener. Can you see this? Let me bring it up really close for you. We'll see what this is. It's a straightener, um, a nine placer. Let's see, six placer, a three placer. Wow, what a gorgeous little kit. A bent nose tip, and there's a single placer in here. Single placer, so let's figure out. Oh, it's um like a magnifying glass, I'm pretty sure. So let's see what this is in here. It's probably a pen, right? Oh, it's a light. There you go. It's a light, so I'm sure that we put this around the end so that it's on a hanger. Do we put pieces into here? Wow, what is this? I hope I've been able to look it up and put it on the screen for you, but this is, yep, I'm not gonna take this piece all the way off because it is a magnifying glass. See that? Woo! How cool! Do you fit it onto here? <gasps> it fits! Oh, do you see this whole thing we've got going on now? So it's a pen with a light. And let's just throw a single placer on here just to be fancy. Oh, I love it. <laughs> How awesome is this? So you can change out the tips. It's with the light on it, with the magnifying glass. This is awesome. In the tin, right, to help with your diamond painting. Because for us people with older eyes, let me tell you, you need all the help that you can get. I used one of these light tips before and I dropped it on the floor. That's my fault, my bad. 
and that broke it. But um, I have my mother. She, oh, look. Oh, I'm not even using it right all the way. So can you see the light? And then you go yellow and off. So it's probably for different types of lighting that it helps you not to be so strong on your eyes. But as I was saying, my I sent my mother one of the lighted tip ones and she loved it so much she purchased more. So yay. So I will hopefully, I will link this for you because what an awesome, and let me tell you, this does not feel like some of the other one, smaller ones. This is substantial. This feels um, sturdy and strong and nice in your hand. It's thicker, can you see that? It's um, a thicker base, it's so that when you hold it with your hands, I always need to use a grip because those tiny, the thin pens, my hands get um, cramped. So, hey, we've already been talking a long time, but I mean, I've never seen a kit like this before. And this is really, this is really cool. <gasps> Thank you, GBFK. And it's a little tin case that you can throw in to take with you when you, if you are on the go with your diamond painting, I do take my diamond paintings to go. So I love the case. Well, all right, let's keep going. Okay, this is a voice from the future. I've edited this and as you can see, it's still a very long video. So I just wanted to tell you up front, if you get sick of this video at any point, you have to scroll all the way to the end, go to the end and see the last diamond painting because it is the cutest thing, all right? If you're sick of it, go to the end. All right, let's keep going. Three days later. Okay, always have a nice clean workspace. Helps to unclutter the mind. That was just really, <laughs> when I started this video, I thought, oh, okay, I know there's a lot in here, but you know, whatever. And I'm about to start dinner. I'll get this done before anybody comes home. And because most of the time I have my family here now. And um, so it's very hard to get filming done. And I thought, well, I better get it in before I start dinner and everybody comes home and I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. I chickened out. This is going to be a special shape. I can tell it's really thin. They have a typical toolkit here for you. Great. All that you need to get it done. Oh, look at their, can you see that? Look at their stars in here. All right, let's see what gets a star. Oh, did I? Yeah, I think I said already that they choose these for me and yada, yada, yada. All right, okay. Oh, she's pretty. Do you see that? Look at this mermaid. Wow, she's covered. Let me um, take this off a little bit. So there is some background that's not, um, these are partial. So when you have areas that are not covered in drills, that's called a partial, and usually special shapes are partial. So there we go, all of that information. But look, so this is it, and look at all of this. Wow, right? This is a heavily, heavily covered. Oh, look, something big is going to go there. I wonder where the stars are going to go. Anyone? Anyone? Bueller? Bueller? Wow. She is really impressive. She is really covered. So this is a 30 by 30. And here's your thumbnail. Hopefully I will be able to find all these for you. And here's the key, how many? Uh, 11. Pretty nice. Look at these little cute symbols here. <gasps> that is really, let's look at the shapes because what is all gonna fit? All I can think of is it's gotta be mostly rhinestones in here because what else is gonna fit that close together, huh? How's that? Is that a little better so you can see her when she's down here? While I'm opening up the package, I'll open up the package off screen, huh? That's not off screen, that's on screen. I'm interested to see what's in here. So how many? 11. Oh, look at, they're starting out right. Look at the pink. And this is almost slightly peachy pink, almost slightly and deep green, and this is like a peridot green. Wow, these are pretty. Let me shake down here for you. Water blue. Oh, I don't even know 
what you want to call this. It's a rosy color. I don't know what else to call that. It's really pretty. These are black. Sometimes when you have black, they do just a regular 310 drill. But this is not. This is a black rhinestone drill. Wow. Pulling out all the stops over there, GBFKE. And gold. And so here are the special ones. So we saw the stars. Adorable. Here's where the big circles are. Look at this big iridescent round. That's nice. And what is this? Um, It's black, you guys. I can't. Oops, sorry. I can't even see. Hold on. Okay, I brought a tray up. I know we've got so many to get through, but... I really, I can't tell, I can't see what this is in here. And I'm really interested. Oh, so it's like a large 310. It's just a really big rhinestone 310. Oh, I love these. Can you see that? The sparkle. I would almost cannibalize this kit for a different art project. These are so cool. I have never seen this before. Where do these go? I don't understand where they go on here. It's number nine or number six? Number nine. Nine is the up arrow. Where? Oh, okay. It's See the up arrow there? It's all the way around the trim of her shell. You know what? This is one of the coolest special shapes one I've seen because it's just kind of different. It's so full. I love this black one. All right. I know we got to keep going, but you guys look at these. Can I just buy these somewhere? Okay, we're not off to a good start. I mean, we're off to a good start product-wise, but I'm going too slow. So you have to go faster. Otherwise, this is going to be like an hour. I'm going to do it double time, so I'm talking like chipmunk the whole time. That'll do it. Okay, so here we are back to regular drill. This is going to be round drill. Look at these sunny summer colors, though. I'm interested to see. We've got ourselves a regular toolkit here. Did I say that? Did I show you here? And flip. <gasps> Who is this little doll? Oh my goodness. Let me try and straighten it out because I think you can't see her. Plastic. Can you see? Well, maybe I'll just have to lift her for you. There she is. What a little doll. Oh. <gasps> She's so cute. She looks like a bunny with a bunny. She's so adorable. <gasps> Look at her little, like, converse down there. Like, little girl converse. This is a 30 by 40. And here, of course, let me take the plastic off. There's a cute little thumbnail. And what's the key say here? Look at the rainbow key. All letters, all letters, all letters. Wait, what? Is that completely letters? Wow, 24. Nice. I don't know if I had that before. I don't even know if I've paid attention to that before. Very nice drill field. Look at all up in here. All the colors. Wow, is she a cutie. <laughs> If I take this down some, can you see her if I spread her back like that? There, that's a little bit better. I love this little outfit. Isn't she like very Holly Hobby-esque? Holly Hobby-esque. Oh yeah, with the little butterfly, little tree. So cute. Should we, oh, that was a terrible job. Let's try that one more time. Get her a little bit flatter. There we go. And her little smile. Okay, let's see what we have for drills for her. No wonder there's some sunny summer colors in here. It's all her dress and the bunny ears. I can't get it open. It's like Chinese. 
finger puzzle here. Oh, here we go. Okay. Ooh, I'm sweating. Okay. That's what kind of shape I'm in. <gasps> Opening up pa packages is a good workout for me. <laughs> good call. Wow, these are neat. These are kind of a different array of like pastel and that muted palette with some neon. Who doesn't need that combination in their life, huh? Does anybody know her? Is she a character in something? She just looks so specific. She's so cute. Oh, here are all the, look at those. Oh, look, one more. Go farther out. And then, ooh, this pretty green too, this blue. And then here we go, hold on. We got just a couple more here. Pink, burgundy, okay, but look at this. Wow, what was that? Oh, that's all that sky color. Isn't that pretty? This is so light. Look at how thin it is. It's like there's nothing in here. It's kind of the way it feels. It feels like there's nothing in here. Come on, open. Must be buried treasure. It doesn't want to let me in. Okay, here we go. So it has to be special shapes. Not a lot of them at that. I don't know. Oh, look at me disparaging it before I get it open. Everything looks iridescent and... Okay, see? Shouldn't talk before you open it. Judge a book by its package. Okay. Oh, it's a mandala. You know, I don't really have many special shape mandalas. For all the mandalas that are out there in special shapes, I don't really have one. I have this huge mandala, but it's an actual diamond painting. So, wow. If I hold it like this, is that better? Oh my gosh, it's almost like a kaleidoscope, right? I mean, I know a lot of them look like kaleidoscopes, but I don't know why this one particularly looks like a kaleidoscope to me. It's a 30 by 30. There is no little thumbnail here. That's all right. Hopefully I can find the image for you. There are 11. Here's the tiny little key. Holy cow. I don't even know if I can focus on this key. It's so little itty bitty. Here's the drill field. Wow. Let's just check out these shapes because these things look awfully, awfully pretty. So there's 11 in here, huh? Wow, this just really didn't feel 11-ish. Felt like 3-ish. I think I have had one before. It was, and I think it was almost, a four, was it a 40 by 50, you guys? I'm going to go back and look because that was crazy. And I think it had three shapes on it. So, I mean partial 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 very very partial but I thought you know what for someone who was just starting out that's not bad why not it was pretty I think it was a flower look at that this is like a gold iridescent I've had purple blue green pink I don't think I've ever had this gold that is gorgeous look at these little blue uh, seed no they're not the seed ones I think these are a little bigger than the seeds, like a marquee. Oh my gosh, it's so light, it like floats down. This one too, here's crystal, just a clear. Right, here's the seed ones, those super tiny, and let's just be honest, slightly annoying to do. Here's the difference in size. See, these are a bit bigger than the, these are the teeniest ones I think that we get. And what in the world? Look, I got some more black. Oh, yeah. These are getting pilfered through. Look at this. Oh, let me try and... They're like 50-50 flipped. I can't get them to flip. But here's a beautiful red. Can you see how it's like got an orange fire in it? And here's the orange. <gasps> These are really some ring dingers, ram dinger, what? And then here's just regular. This one I call broken disco ball. Isn't that what that looks like? And then here are the bigger ones. Here's this. This is like the one that we had in the first one, right? This big round clear iridescent. And But look at these. I call this, I think this is like a mermaid color. 
Isn't it kind of mermaid colorish? With these big, huge slivers. <gasps> oh, I really love these. Honestly, it doesn't feel like we're getting anywhere. <laughs> Did I say already that we need to go faster, but we need to go a lot faster. <laughs> this one feels bigger. This one's a regular. Yep, we're back to, here's some rounds and regular toolkit. Oh my gosh, look at this wax. I don't think I've ever seen wax. It must have dried out. It's shattered. <laughs> That's some dried out wax. I wonder how that works. You know what? I think I'm going to pull that one out and try that one. I've never had one do that. I wonder if it works terribly like you think it would or if it would work great. Ready? I don't, what? Oh. It's upside down. It's a unicorn. Oh my God. With what? With kitties? Can you see that? This is some little girl psychedelic craziness here. Can you see? So it's a unicorn in front of maybe like a magic frame or something. And it, is this a handle or this is a ring here? But then we've got butterflies, but can you see this? This is kitty, and then, you know, this rainbow stars. I mean, all little girl stuff. But these are kitty butterflies. <laughs> That's a little creepy. I, I feel it is, to me, a little creepy. It's a 30 by 40. Here's the thumbnail. Hopefully, I can find this crazy image. So we can all decipher. I might leave that up a little longer than usual so we can all just really take in all the details of this one. What? <gasps> what in the world? Here's the key. Oh, they have the best key. Look at this key. So easy. Look at the drill field. So nice for all the psychedelic craziness of it. That is really, aw, look at the sweet little eyes. And it has a pendant maybe, or, oh, that's the rainbow shining through. But these are just. I guess it is a little creepy. Those creep me out. Oh my goodness. Should we see the colors for this bad boy? Here we go. Oh, I just saw this one too. This is a kitty. I thought this was just like color behind it. That's the kitty he's flying. So you see the back wings. Oof. Oh my God. It's like crazy nightmarish. Like he's gonna say, <laughs> never mind. Completely inappropriate stuff I was just gonna say for a little girl's diamond painting. Here we go. Oh, I should move this away. Let's just get through this strip. Ooh, is that 386? What is it that I like? 3864? I don't know what that is. Oh, 3866. <gasps> I like that color very much. I want like a, it's like an oatmeal sweater, right? How many colors were in this? Anyone? Anyone? This is just the funkiest haul I think I've done. These are some... Oh no, we had the bunny girl. She was cute. The mermaid girl was kind of wild, but I think it's this one. This one. This is just really creeping me out. <laughs> and it's got a lot of colors. Holy cow. And keep going and keep going. Keep going. And one more. Okay, we'll see what we have now. That, that That's like everything a little girl likes. Unicorns, kitties, hearts, rainbows, butterflies, threw up on one diamond painting. That's amazing. This feels bigger, actually. It looks like a 30 by 40, but I bet it's like one of those 40 by, oh my gosh, 40 by 60? Anybody have a guess on that? This is a long one. This has some unit, what in the world? I don't have any sense of what this is. Ready? What are we, oh, it's um, it's a fairy. It's a big, wow, she's a really big fairy. She's 30 by 60, I thought it was gonna be a 60. You can't really see her though. She's so long. What if we see her in sections? 
Look at, she's pretty, huh? Look at this purple. I don't know what I was looking at in there. There's gotta be a ton of purple in here. Here, let's try this. 30 by 60. Here's the thumbnail. Right, she's awfully pretty. Here's the key for you to see how many colors. 24. That seems to be a popular number today, does it not? 34. Maybe if I take off all of this plastic all the way down. Wow. See this large bouquet of flowers that she has? Look at her purple hair, braided hair. <gasps> Holy cow. This isn't really my jam, but oh, and look at she's got butterflies on her. See her braided hair? See this bouquet of flowers? Does somebody out there like her? Because she is very pretty. Oh my goodness. For 24 colors, that's interesting. Because let me show you. Hold on. Let's put the plastic back on before I ruin her. Because I can see myself absolutely ruining her. Let's see. this all straightened out okay this is what I want to show you down at the bottom here look at this confetti down here Wow right those are gonna be such pretty blues look at that for the water look at her dress I think her legs show through a little bit and then her dress comes back in I wish I could get a better, maybe if I take a picture of it and insert it, you can see this canvas better. This is hard to see. She's so long. Because usually if you have, you know, I can put it down here um, portrait wise. And that way you can get a closer look. Maybe I'll just try it. Can you see her better portrait wise there? <laughs> and then we'll just flip it. That is so pretty. All right, let's look at the um, let's look at the drills. Well, honestly, who wouldn't like lavender knee length hair that thick to braid like that? I mean, washing it would be a, just a pain, but it's awfully pretty. Here are the colors. This is what I was looking at in there. I mean, you know, look at these these muted mossy, and then here, what a crazy color palette this is. Ooh, is that 939? What a pretty blue. Look at this. See, this is like a muted blue. Look at this. This is, must be all those colors in the bottom. Look at all these blues. If I string it out like this for you, see that? Oh, she's going to be a dream. She is awfully pretty. Like I said, I'm not such a fairy girl, but... The more I look at her and the colors, hold on, there's a couple more here. The prettier she gets. There's just not as much purple as I thought. It's more blue. Look at these blues. Oh, I love this. Oh, of course I love the pink. Okay, we're moving along. Now, I do feel about now that we're actually getting somewhere, but... Oh, this one I thought, I don't know, is this a 30 by 40? Yeah, it's going to be a 30 by 40. Ooh, look at the neon greens in there. Toolkit. All right, ready? What am I looking at? Oh, it's just a sweet, this is just a sweet little image. It's an umbrella with roses. It's just a sweet little one. It is a 30 by 40. Look at those pretty flowers, though, huh? Look at that. 30 by 40. Here's the thumbnail. The thumbnail's adorable. Here's your key. Here we go. Look at 23 colors. I could go straight. It's the way I'm holding my arms. I'm sorry. I'm always giving it to you crooked. Is that 3865? Sure enough. In the background there with the bow and the rose some pretty purple should we see the see the drills that's the word I'm trying to get out here these are pretty colors this is 
spring. Isn't this very spring-like, right, with the umbrella, with the roses? It's a very spring image. Wow. These are some gorgeous pinks. Ooh. That's almost a neon, huh? Oops. What am I doing here? Everybody move. Okay. Here we go. All right. Pretty greens. Look at, those are different colors. They look very close, right? That's, oh, look at all those. That's always nice when you get those um, different tones of one color. Then the sh you know the shading is going to turn out beautifully. Hold on, we've got, oh, here's your 3865. Nothing much. But then, purple and pink. Okay, we've moved into the bigger sizes. We're moving along. Sorry I didn't spend as much time on the last one, but it was no purple-haired fairy, huh? That purple-haired fairy was pretty... She was something all right. Here we go. We've got some colors. We've got a tool kit. And what have we got for an image? That's not right. That's right. Oh, oh my goodness. He is so cute. He looks like he would be one of those that says, I love you to the moon and back. You know, all those variations that are out. Doesn't he look like one of those? He is really adorable. Aw. So he's 40 by 40. There's the thumbnail for you. It's a tiny little thumbnail. And here is, oops, here is the key. Where's the key? There's the key. And he has, look at their keys are so clear. I love their symbols and their keys. 20 colors. And this, I'm not sure if you can see this. Maybe all the canvases were, but this one seems to be particularly sparkly to me. But look at, wait, look at his little face. Oh my goodness. This would be fun for a little baby's room, wouldn't it? Put lights around the edge of it on the frame and you could make it into a little night light thing if I don't ruin it here there we go oops wow that was a really terrible job there we go there he is the little cutie okay let's look at his drills put him up there yeah I bet a lot of three a lot of three eight six five I guess for this guy. Let's start with that. We'll start with the boring stuff. And then this is all, you know, muted palette, pastels, but it's almost like the whole rainbow in pastels. There's so many colors in here. Look. Oh, that one's a vibrant. But these are all, oops, hold on. We're flip flops here. Look at all those blues. Just so pretty. Oh, this one, you guys, this one is, this one's like butter. Okay. Here we go. And just some great. Okay. Did you guys, if you need coffee, if you need to take a coffee break, I totally understand. Pause the video. Go get yourself some sustenance. Go for lunch for the love of Pete. This thing is so long. Oh, I thought this one was going to be longer, but it is not. It's like another 40 by 40. It felt... Is that boat bigger? You know what? I've just opened too many. I'm just losing it now. Ooh, look at this mossy green. Okay. Okay. <laughs> when I open it up, upside down and I try and make sense of it, it is crazy. Look, we've got another fairy. You guys, we're going to have to, I'm collecting these fairies again. We're going to have to do another fairy giveaway. But these are not, these are not special shape fairies. These are full drill fairies. I know some of you guys like these fairies because I had a huge response last time. It's a 40 by 40. Here she is. She's super pretty. Here's the key. How many? 24 colors. Look at her face. 
with her wings look at these wings and she's on this pretty wreath hold on hold on i'm gonna move there so then you can see her better without the glare there we go wow look at that dress so now which do you like better the uh you want to have lavender hair or this pinkish rosy red hair I don't know. It's a tough call. That's a tough call. I would have to be in a vat of bleach forever to try and get anything. And then all my hair would fall out, so what would it matter? Okay, should we look at her colors? She's going to be neat. She's going to have Christmas colors, right? She doesn't look Christmassy, but then look at it. This is like forest green and Christmas red. She's going to have Christmas colors. Well, this side doesn't look like Christmas colors, but... Let's see when we get in here. Yeah, that's interesting that you can put Christmas colors together and not have it look Christmassy at all. Or maybe she does look Christmassy to some. <gasps> wow. Look at this array of colors here. Okay. Can I find this line? Here, we'll start with the short one first. Oh, I love this yellow. It feels like there's a ton of colors in here. You know what, though? There is no, like, 666 or 817. Oh, maybe that one is. There we go. Keep going. That's got to be some 310. Oh, look at the 310 escaped into the purple. We were making a run for it. Oh, my gosh. That has everything in it. Here we go. Oh, all of these guys. Everybody moved down one. See this? This is the reddest the red is. There's no 666 in here. So although she looks that red, she's not going to turn out that red. Look at this burgundy. Here's the forest green. Oh, this is such a crazy, I don't know what you call that color. And here's some pretty greens. Okay, here we've got a naked one here. So we might as well just, we only have two left. This one, and then one more, and we can be done, you guys. So hang in there. We're almost there. This one has some pretty colors. Let's just flip it, right? At this point, there's just no mystery left. We just want to see. Oh, shut the front door. Don't worry, be happy. Look at this cute bee. This is so hilarious. And you'll see why I find this so hilarious later on in the month, probably. This is, uh, isn't it really, it's really, that's a cute little bee. Don't worry, be happy. And this lettering looks like it's going to turn out fantastically. That T might be a little worrisome, but I would just take out one of these. Let me just move this way. Oops, you can't see. I just want to show you what I mean to, I'm always trying to help people with their lettering because lettering can be tricky sometimes. See this one W right here? This one black one? Take that guy out. And then that white circle in the center would be bigger. And then I think you would see the T perfectly. Besides that, I think everything else is good to go. He's 40 by 40. Here's his super cute thumbnail. He's adorable. For summertime, 24. That's what they go to, huh? I'm going to go back and look. You guys, is that the most colors? 24? At least it is in this group. Look at the beautiful wing there. Isn't that really pretty? And the yellow flowers. He is just sweet. I just wanted to zoom you in so you could see him. He is really, really... This is... This is... I should have ended on this one. This is such a super fun summer image. I... I love it, but of course I love it. I kind of love everything, don't I? <laughs> it's the theme of this channel. Okay. What do we have here for colors? Is we going this way? I don't think I can go this way. I usually go the other way. Ooh, that is pretty. I want a sweater in that color. Oops, come on you guys, help me out. There we go.
Oh, look at all this pink. Where does the pink go? I honestly, I don't see it. It's got to be mixed in with that background. Oh, that background. Did I show, did you see it when I showed it up close? That background, now that I see it, is super confetti. Look at all those pretty colors. Summer colors. Yay! And, oh, end on a high note. Okay, last one. I am just not even going to try and pull that apart. I'm going to pull out the knife. Because now I've had it. Ooh, don't put your finger below that. This is so sharp. It's crazy. Okay, what do we have for the last one? Is it another 40 by 40? Is that 40? That's not. That's probably 40 by 50, huh? Ooh! It's squares! How cool! Look at the back of those squares. Those look beautiful. All right, let's just keep going now. Because I know we're all tired. We all want to go to bed. <laughs> it's been 24-hour unboxing. Here we go. <gasps> what? is it is it a baby sloth oh who what in the world do you see this can you see that oh it's so big hold on there's that better the level of cute on this is off the charts what, what a great diamond painting to end on Oh, with the flowers in the hair. I love these stylized leaves. And she has a little flower in her hand. Oh my goodness. I cannot wait to see these colors. Those are those colors that I saw in there. Oh, it is it is a 40 by 50. Here is the thumbnail. I will definitely find that image for you. I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Here is the key. And this is a square. I know I said that, but I'm just so enthralled with this image. Let's look at the field, drill field for the square. So up here, there you go. But down here, you can see the lines a little better. Super clear. Look at the pretty colors in the flower. Look at the eyes. Look at the little face. Oh my God. You know what I'm going to do now? I'm going to go back to the beginning and put in like a note or something that says people have to make it to the end because you cannot miss this. What I mean? Oh, I think these are all, what is this? Pinks or... 3770. Okay, let's look at the colors, but I'm going to have a hard time not staring at this. This is next level cute. All right, let's pull out let's pull out the drills. Wow, there's a lot in here. This is 24 colors, but this is heavy. For a 40 by 50, I guess. I like a 40 by 50. I feel like I can get a 40 by 50 done and it has more surface area than a 30 by 40. Of course it does, but to get that clarity. So let's look at these drills. These are, look at this color. Oh, I hope I found, well, I know I found this image for you so that we can all see how much it costs because I am hoping it's, right in the price range for everybody who wants it because there has got to be more people than me that think that this thing is so stinking cute with the prettiest colors. Hold on, let me flip this over. Let's go from this end. This is that one we saw when it was in the bag. Oh, pretty green. I mean, just a hint of these pinks. And then this must be 939. 
That's a lot. Look at how beautiful that navy is. I love it. I say this all the time, but I love it when they substitute like 939 or that dark brown one. Whatever that dark. Oh, maybe it's right here. Oh, no, this is dark green. But for black, black uh, for black round, for instead of a black background, you know, you put one of these colors in. I love that. I think it sets it off so well. Some of these, oh, look at this. I mean, it looks a little dusty in here, but I don't think the drills look too dusty. I think it's just around the package. Ooh. Can we focus? That is pretty. And here, oh, just the last few. <gasps> okay, you guys, we made it to the end. If you are still with me at this point, thank you so much for supporting my channel. It means the world to me to have all of the subscri subscribers and the comments and the likes. It really does mean a lot to me. Thank you so much. Thank you to GBFKE for this amazing haul. For the pen, I mean, I totally even forgot there was a pen in this haul by the time I got to the end. I'm a little delirious now. I'm going to need to sit down. But this was really beautiful. There was some really great stuff in here. Thank you so much, everybody. Have a great day. Bye-bye.